Jilpa is going to be out. Speaking of Frost, this man, Ray for 10 too, but it's going to be Demoniac, the Demon Incarnate, the Harlequin set. Popping out of cell just to say hello for just a second. Not playing that good old subtlety. He's on that assassination trade, which actually is looking kind of good for Ted too as well. Immediate stun, full go. Not going to go for the death mark. Actually, it's going to be a trinket as the remorse switch does end up locking his bones down. Second stun to follow. It is going to be Chilpos trying to see if he can mitigate some of the poison damage as the poison is coursing through his veins. Big sepsis, death mark is available. That's a lot of bleed and poison damage Chilpos has to mitigate. Maybe a situation where he's looking at an IB. Up. Definitely looking to sacrifice the goal and impossible. Lichborn out a little early as the double bleeds are up onto chills. The death pack or death mark rather doing quite a bit of work. There goes the goal exploded. Trying to see if we catch up to the rogue. The ambush is out of demoniac. It's gonna IBF out of that stun. Next stun is gonna be up in demoniac. Can't really stop this one. Chill has himself some an opportunity to maybe make some kind of a play, but not a lot of damage right now. He's just having to play it super defensive. Stun of demoniac with a chain of ice to follow. As long as you can just keep it down on demoniac and keep in control with the chain you'll actually might be fine but chill pills got himself a human racial maybe can use that here blind or demonic for just a second maybe look at a death pack situation that's going to be a stun no odds for this one let's see human racials is he fine short stun demonic not going to do a lot it's going to give himself some bit of damage but it's going to be dragon flying up above demonic got lots of damage big and venom into a vanish does have a dot unless chill pills can find him right now he's uh, going to be out the offensive smoke about to fall oh uh, you got to get some death and decay or some next stun would be deadly human racial i think it's still up unless he's already used like a normal trinket it looks like i don't see a normal trinket on his bars but like i don't even know i don't even trust the ui here sometimes as chill is sat up for a second demoniac still got to cheat death still got a blind though so as long as he gets himself a proper blind he could still win this i think not being subtlety he is forced to play a little bit more aggressively against the death that is going to be a trinket human racial out could go for a blind before the stun gets him he's going to go for the blind stun is going to be on him for just a second the blind and stun actually same duration second stun right after oh this is to follow demoniac in the bad spot blind right after by chill pills as he's kind of limited on what he can do big of blitz it's gonna be sepsis at least he's gonna leave chippos bleeding out and poison love he's gonna make it so much harder for him to recover as makima charging out next i like the blood fang set it looks or rather not blood fang set but onyx blood set just a couple of shadow strikes a secret technique nothing you could do a chippo just had nothing left big barrage out of seaward but it's gonna be immediate invisible makima and see we're trying to see if we can find the rogue does go for the arcade orb doesn't even realize he actually sent it just to get him out the open it's gonna be second or bring a fire on one side trying to see if he can push the rogue into the ring but he's trying to see if he can avoid it it is going to be a touch of the magic that touch of the magic is so good against rogues by the way if you guys i feel like we usually get to see uh jayhawk play arcane and he i almost never see him use such a magic maybe he is using it but it's like i just don't see the uh animation for it it depends how the game like as a spectator does it treat me as a horde player or as a lions player because if i'm horde and jayhawk is horde i'm seeing like the what if an ally would see and touch the magic just doesn't have a oh wait a second bowling on to back a barrage wait a second <laughs> where was that touch of the bat oh touch of death but cheat death oh i think makima might have got screwed over and cheat death i didn't even see it pop up unless it did it popped up and then just the man's died right after it that is so unfortunate. WTB Jungle is going to be up next playing that survival. Got himself the katana. I like the. Whoa. Look at that set. Big charge over onto the Seawork with a coordinated assault. Trying to coordinate his attacks with the pet, but a uh, halt of time is going to try to see if he can reverse it. Mad damage on one to my Jungle. The man is just under a ton of pressure. Touch of the Magi is not going to be able to break past the turtle shell. The man is in a bit of a treat, trying to go for a little bit more health. Big Arcanosphere going to knock him back for a moment. Missiles right after him. Unless he can close the gap. Root onto Jungle. I think I should want to go for him for Harpoon. Scatter onto Seawork. Maybe he can make some enough work off of this one. Survive with the fittest. Big Harpoon right now and see work with a quick and just to give himself a bit of a dr jungle not in a great spot big explosive one to see but a barrage could end them right here see has has some resources with second barrage every barrage is going to be deadly trying to see if he can silence see work is going to be able to go for a proper silence but the man needs a recovery that or a cc trying to see if he can disrupt see work on his cooldowns and it's going to be a big charge but man that's the magic death shocker i'm actually doing quite a bit of a number hold on a second see work might be in a bit of a bad spot trying to give as much healing as a feral druid discharging him with flexi bites does not get himself a proper reset i don't know how see work just found him but he did find him out of stealth. As long as you can just keep him at bay, keep barraging him over and over, you can get a slow. Holy smokes, Arcane is nuts. I feel like it's just Seawark, man. It's, I don't even know if it's just Arcane as a class. 
I think it's my man Steve. Like that's literally his bread and butter, dude. He play. He wakes up in the morning. He's like, "What do I want to play? That's really, really fun for me." Arcane. He played it during the good days and during the bad days. See, so honestly, you gotta give him some credit, dude. You gotta give this man respect. It's same with Chills. Chills like six of frost. He tries to play mess around with Holy and does really well as Holy. Don't get me wrong, but he does stick to those frosty guns whenever possible, even though the spec is like kind of mediocre-ish or whatever stun onto Seabark for just second roots might actually be able to help slow down Seabark and play Shrinket trying to see if he can reverse blink away from flex using his roots and as many Novas as he can with Icy Nova just to control flex as much as possible and his flex charges in Seabark is able to disengage fairly easily trying to see if he can get on the other side or to flex it but it's no longer has himself any big uh, defensive mad orb that's gonna be Barrage oh with a touch of the magic the orb their catasphere built up built up but does end up kind of adding on to the touch the magi damage my goodness once you got him in a couple of missiles back to back it's just a rough spot to be him see does get found out with that Faye as dj trap walker tried to see if he can get over there that was a win but it looks like he ran out of mobility to catch up to see the dragon kick together with rolls is a lot of movement that you can really just help yourself just get over to the other side of the arena to the other side of the zip code but i guess see being arcane as long as you're very careful with your mobility you can somewhat counter it. Mad crits on the silver, but he's not super worried. All the time keeping him plenty alive. Our chemistry just to give him some headspace. And DJ got himself lots of damage, but doesn't really have a lot of ways to close that gap. Karma, as well as damp and harm. Diffuse magic will not be available, but all the other defenses may be used up right now. Touch of the magic is not gonna feel that great. Radio fire doesn't quite clip you. But he's gonna try to see if he can maybe pour it out in the open, catch it up to see where knock back with a root, trying to see if he can maybe counter a tiger's loss out of DJ into a root right after. Got himself shooting power in cap close enough in order to be able to stop a lot of that cooldown recovery. I see where he's still trying to see if he can maybe fish for an ice block, but he got through options. He could either try to see if he can keep running or go in for counter offensive burst, make DJ play defensively or fish for ice block and that's he needs a lot of cooldown reduction for that one i think it's going to be like a mix of kiting and doing damage finding an opportunity big arcane surge nowhere near dj is kind of out in the open does he have a port back it's actually a lot decided this is full burst on a team like mad hits back to back our is going to be deadly unless this man somehow survives a big sphere to follow the man gets in for massive hits such as magic cracks right through him oh my oh uh, i like your mock by the way that looks so good with green Okay, we gotta give this a go because a lot of the dudes over in team one didn't even get a chance to play. We got a dragon in there. We got a priest in there. We got a C back in there. We got these boys another chance at it, man. But that's C where, dude. Yeah, I'm hoping that this Arcane could still do stuff like this for 10 too. I'll be so sad if they no longer can do fun stuff like this. <laughs> we'll see, dude. We'll hope for the best, honestly. That or.